night of first here in Madison as the Bozeman Bucks were representing Bay County as the first program to reach the final four since Rutherford in 2001. Could the Bucks advance to the class 1R state finals? Let's find out. You couldn't have scripted a worse start for Bozeman. A touchdown, two point conversion, touchdown, two point conversion, and a pick six make it a 22 to nothing ball game less than four minutes in. The Bucks finally catch a break after a fumble recovery. Peyton Gay scrambling in the backfield, gonna find Gabe Reyna across the middle. He has a good block sealing the sideline, and Bozeman cuts it to 22 to six after a missed two point conversion. The Bucks will earn a safety, but other than that, it's all Cowboys in the second quarter, scoring another 25 uncontested. None prettier than this fade route in the back of the end zone, getting behind the Bucks secondary, 47 to eight Cowboys. Well, right before the half, Bozeman shows a sign of life as Gay throws a beautiful ball to John Boy Hansen for the score, so it's 47 to 15 at the break. Third quarter, Madison scoring on the first drive, drawing a running clock, and that, of course, speeds things up a bit. Also adding salt to the wound, the Cowboys ending Bozeman's season in the state semifinals, but the Bucks will score once more before it's all said and done, making it a 61 to 22 final. After the ball game, Bozeman head coach Jason Griffin says he's proud of his guys for this historic run. Most of all, I'm proud to be the football coach of this team. I'm proud to be the football coach of Bozeman. It's just an unbelievable uh, experience. You can coach a lifetime and not have a group of kids and a group of assistant coaches and an administration and a, and a, and a, and a, a student body and everything that's behind us like this. I mean, the Bucks season coming to a close, but not before a historic run. The best record in program history, two playoff victories, and the first Final Four appearance in school history as well.